All right, let's give this another go. Uh, let's see. Unless we could make it to that other side. What do you think? You probably could. That way you wouldn't have to deal with all the bots. I mean, I'm probably going to have to deal with them anyway. Maybe? Ooh, never mind. Yeah. Oh, actually, you made I can it. make it via platform cheating or something. Okay, what do we got up here? Seeing is there's nothing. It was just for that plating. All right. Wait, really? No, there has to be a way around the right. Look. Can you make it across? I mean, over to this? Yeah. You're right. And then there's a place up to the right, right? Not really. Oh, no, that rock ledge isn't good. However, what I can do is uh, cheese it and just start shooting these guys from afar. Yeah, I don't know if they... No. Nope. Oh! <laughs> they, can... they can come say hi. They We're leaving. jumped up. Oh, we are leaving fast. That guy is very high level. Maybe it would be better just to blitz it towards the object. Ow, what the? Div. That thing two shots me. Never mind. Wow. Now, where was the beacon? I, oh, are you thinking we should just leave? No, 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 no. Where is the signal? Up ahead somewhere. It's in this zone. We have to traverse this area, but I guess I could just ignore them. Just run past. The problem is they've got that charge, and it's very hard for me to get out of the way. Well, I noticed that when you jump down, you go immediately into the area. Is there another point that you could proceed from that... To go across? Not that I've seen. But then again, I, I haven't looked that much. Finally I, oh, back. I didn't even get to keep my loot for that. Yeah, so it's on the opposite end of this area. Is there an easy way of cross, though? I mean, you can jump on top of that cylinder. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, get out of there! Run! I'm a little bit worried about the core hounds or whatever their names are. Charging well, me. No, it looks like they've... they seem to have forgotten you. Yeah, so it looks like I've I've left their aggressive area. So I think I'm just gonna stay away from it for the time being. This game has terrible loading mechanics and I hate it. These support tunnels have sure taken a beating. What happened to the core bots that were supposed to maintain them? I mean what happened to all of the core bots? You're you're asking the questions in kind of the wrong order here. Mm-hmm. Okay, let's see. How high level are these? These are level six. Okay, so that's manageable. Need to weaken it first. Whoa, there's another ape one. Okay, so we've got a big monkey. And I don't know where instance extract? What? Alright. Okay. I ain't gonna question it. Alright, so we've got worn canine pads, though that's not anything. Okay, is that breakable? Nope, it's a cord. Okay. There we go. Where'd, um... Oh, there he is. Yep. <laughs> okay, he wasn't there for that fight, and I was kind of confused. No. I'm gonna get this. Supposedly, there we go. Another break in the tunnel. Well, move those hover plates into the right position. We can use them to get across. Oh. Power cell bots are missing. Mm-hmm. These little guys run off to. I wonder where. Where <laughs> could they have gone? Oh boy. How would somebody do this? Oh hey, there's a teleportation spot. I yeah, think. I was just gonna wait. What? What is that? What is, is that? Why is it scary? A it was a, oh, it was it was a, a ring. <laughs> I don't know. Let's do this, Violet. Okay. I think that worked as a checkpoint, so hopefully if and when we die, we don't have to reload into this entire area again. Unless I go elsewhere or something. This area is big. Yep, that it is, and you have to platform it. Blech. Then again, like, I shouldn't be surprised. Platforming is kind of like 90% of this game. really wish the music would keep going, though. I, th I think that's actually the, the most annoying part for me. Oh, what was extract? Oh, does that save one of the bots? Yeah. Why would someone lock up a bunch of cell bots? Let's see. 
Don't know if necessarily this is the way to go. Oh, hey, the mining rig is actually still going. Yep, for and looks like it reason. is grinding away. Okay. So we've got that going down. What about up? Well, there... Yeah, there was that ring. Oh, no! No! What? What? Yeah, Hi. jump back. Yeah, Hello. Good. Okay. I almost made it, and then I didn't make it. Be nice if the camera zoomed out a little bit when I'm doing, like, crazy jumps. Yeah, I was thinking of that, how it just seemed like you're too close to the character. Yeah. Like, it's a great angle for shooting. But it's a terrible angle for, like, me trying to get around and do things. Don't worry. You're safe with me. Uh, at least it gives me that, like, uh... These core bots are blue. It's interesting. Well, the platform itself was blue. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I guess it kind of works. Um, Ooh, chest. The one thing I do like about it is it gives us that, like, reticle for landing. The problem is I can't see it 90% of the time because when I jump, the camera defaults to looking straight forward. Okay, wild child augment. There's not a way of, like, zooming out, is there? Uh, no, it doesn't look like it. Now, can you look up? What's in this? Can you... Nah, we, I, maybe we have to get on top of it. I find it hard to believe. E not going over there immediately. Oh, there's the last one. Okay, well that's useful. Uh, this doesn't do the, the red blowy uppy thing. Yeah, I don't think I can get on top of this one. Um, let me see, I want to kind of look around. This area is a lot more expansive. There's like a kind of elevator, a bunch of those. It's probably why it, it took so long to load in. Yeah, no, this ar this area is huge for a reason. It's just... Wait, before we go anywhere, is there any point to this platform? It doesn't look like it. Nope. I'd hate to, uh, I'd, I'd hate to lose out on something important. <laughs> just because, uh, the game was being finicky. Okay. Uh, I mean, I can just shoot him off. Right. Okay. Don't get crushed by it either. I don't think I'm going to get crushed by it. Like, they don't move. Oh. Okay. I thought for a moment that it was going to come back. No. And you missed. There's that, oh, though. No. Uh-oh. Oh, wait. No That's enemies. just Mac. Oh. Oh, it's mud. Interesting. Huh. Wasn't expecting that. Yuck. Well, don't get too deep in that stuff. Yeah. Might suck you under. Except for dead. now kind of looks like it. Oh. Whoa. You just went through the rock. Okay. That's an eight. Yeah, I'm not keen on fighting it. But it's only one. So part of it is we're going to have to start fighting these guys anyway. Right. And so it seems like a good idea to kind of be a little bit pugilistic here. A oh, bunch of quicksand. Yeah, a bunch of quicksand. Don't think I'm going to truck with it. Uh, it. It does seem like it might not be a bad idea to run around shooting things, just because uh, leveling up increases my gun's damage. Mm -hmm. I think right now I'm at the exact same level as they are. Um, but like, if You I just was, can't take on multiple of them at once. Kind of. Oh no, that was just him doing dog things. Okay. <laughs> hmm. How do we get up from here? I guess there's probably some platforms back this way that I missed. Yeah, they're there. Yep. I was just kind of hoping I could find some more things to fight. Cause... So you're abandoning the main objective? I suppose oh, hey. you can go around for these. I'm not. I'm not abandoning the main objective. I'm just trying to get back to it. Sort of. Because if you notice. Ooh. To get up there, we've got to be. You have to go back up. Alternatively, or she sort of scrambled up that edge. Yeah, the re the climbing with the rocks is a little bit awkward. It works though. Oh, what? you always miss it by a smidge. Yeah. Come on. What is this? Okay, let's just. Actually, this is really easy to platform back past. Mm -hmm. I love I love platforming games, but the ones that like make you do k 
kind of like pixely perfect stuff. Always a bit on the frustrating side. I'm not even gonna bother with the other one. Yeah, that's Got good. It. You need to extend that final jump, but it's gonna lift its shields right on you, isn't it? And it didn't matter anyway. Huh. Yep. So I think you need to shoot at the next one when you land on that Absolutely. one. Absolutely. I, I didn't mean to hit it. Uh, hit the second one. My shots just kept going and, and hit it. Don't question the fact that I can fuse with rock walls. It's, <laughs> it's not an issue or anything. Okay. I'm curious. Originally, I thought this game was kind of going to be more oriented towards, uh, like, younger audiences and stuff. Wait, what? Why? Um, mainly just because, you know... Uh, third-person platformers, you know, were always aimed at us when we were younger. Wow, that was... Tough. Yeah! Like, honestly, jumps like that should... Probably not be that hard. Maybe we just get a triple jump soon. Ow. Oh no! Max on fire! I'm on fire! Mac has better defenses than I do! Okay, what do we get here? More Watch blueprints. Out. Yeah. wonder how... Uh, how you're expected to jump onto that? I mean, this is actually surprise surprisingly jumpable. Oh, yeah. that was close. I don't like this. I don't have that bad of an issue with vertigo. Do you want to go up or down? We go up. We go up. Mainly oh, hey. because it's a lot easier to get to where we need to go. No, I just want to turn around left. and look for right? a second. I know, there's, the, there's that platform there. Then you also could go on the roof. Yeah, I could. Oh, hey. Warp point. Good stuff. Okay. Looks like we got a couple of things up here, actually. It's just basic components. I kind of mm. wish, instead of giving us these, like, collectible parts, it was more of a... Oh. Maybe now, are I... these things that respawn or not? Mm, I don't think so. I could be wrong, though. I okay, know. now you need to find your platform right there. Yep. There we go. Okay, then we destroy all of the boxes. Because money is important! Whoa! Yep. And then also scary. Okay, hello. Now, can you... Access these logs in some kind of file or folder because you could get a translation for it there. I hope so. Because watch Violet know everything and we just can't understand it. Wait, what? It leapt on top. Well... That nah, destroyed him. Alright. That was weird. Let's see if I can warp up there in any way. How'd that happen? What was that? It was <laughs> dumb. Maybe you've been upgrading Mac too much. I, I guess. <laughs> you know, I don't actually have a whole lot of problems with upgrading him too much, because if he can fight everything off without my assistance, that makes my life substantially easier, considering... Mm -hmm. My ill luck with things. Okay, there are goodies up here. A lot of goodies, actually. Oh. Wait, didn't get this one. There, there we go. go. They look like they're on fire and stuff, and I'm like, ooh, super goodies. Nope, they're just the same as everything else for some reason. Okay. Ah, just grab it onto that nut. Yep. Like the platforming oh, hey. thing in this game is a little wonky. There's something up here, right? Yeah. Oh. Oh. Hi. Okay. Let's not do that in the future, maybe. I don't know. What is... What is this? Maybe you need to... Uh-oh. Well, that was fast. Maybe you need to load it into that drill. Look back there. Or, never mind. 
Not interested right now. Got other things to worry about, like Doggo being Jerk Doggo. Okay. Okay, there we go. Don't want to get shot. Oh, a purple uh, it's one. It's a purple dog. And it's massive, and it has teeth. Ow. I don't know what the other dog's doing. It changed colors. Oh, why colors. did I press that? Okay. No, stop, Whoa. stop! Yeah, so one of the problems is enemies can, like, smack me multiple times. If I'm not careful... Uh, they're both aggroed on me. Here's what we're gonna do. Fuck! Well, okay. You can't jump up that. Okay, here we go. Dog turned red. Dog turned red. That means we're good. What? Oh! Well, I guess that works. The other the other dog was in the way. But I guess Mac got it. Okay. Um, so yeah, it looks like the uh, core bot's supposed to go in here. I think one already inserted yeah, itself. Yeah, it did. This one here. I don't know what this is. I think oh. it's an opening. Yeah. Yeah, this is an opening for a dungeon. So. So I'll need to find more. Yeah, obviously. I'm just gonna look around though. The fighting is hard, but uh, the more levels I get, the less hard it's gonna be. I just hope I get the blue gun soon, so we actually can fight them. Hmm. Okay. I don't see any core bots up here. That's probably something that we have to find them strewn throughout the entire level and come back for. Well, go back to the left. Uh, you mean this way? Yeah. Okay. Because we haven't really explored more around the rim yet. We have and we haven't. It's not like there's a whole lot here. Like, there's... Well, what about those platforms out there? Well, okay, so we've got this steam vent here, which is supposed to propel uh, us over that direction. we don't have that. Yeah. And that looks like over there. That's a um That's a big core. Yeah, that's that's one of the power orbs it looks like. Yeah, if you look at We got a couple there. Let's see, we've got the cradle. The cradle. Interesting. They are Oh, they're fast travels. Never mind. We've got the assembly. Here's the dungeon we're right next to. Oh, the house. Oh wait, of look steel. behind you. Yeah. Well, the objective is all the way up in the northern corner. Yeah, yeah. We're not. Uh, we're just looking at like other stuff. Mm -hmm. Um. But yeah, this thing behind us called is called the House of Steel. Requires ten cores, and also level twenty five. Okay. Nowhere. Yeah. yeah. So like a lot soon. of these, we're not going to be able to do for quite some time. So I could mess around and look at this stuff. Oh, hey, over there. Yeah, that's another core bot. Well, why don't you insert it, and then... Yeah. Or it's already doing that. I think it that. goes automatically. Um, but, like, I bet there's another core bot somewhere up there, taking the ramps up and going along these cranes. We need a lot more abilities, and honestly, we need levels before I even want to think about this place. So I'm not going to go out of my way for it. If I could, like, go in there and somehow, like, struggle my way through getting a ton of EXP. <laughs> but, uh... Can't do that. So not even gonna bother. That's nah, gonna send out some bugs after you. Well, this one I can shoot at. Oh yeah, I can kill the, these Oh, it things. opens up the ports. And it's going there down. There it goes. To be fair, would actually... Was tempted to just keep shooting that thing forever. And just let it spit little bugs at me, but I get the feeling after a certain point it probably uh. would, like, stop. I don't know, I'm just, I'm just trying to figure out how I can be less killable. I guess picking up some more of those HP things would be nice. But, like, armor, armor would also be nice. It's interesting, uh, our, our HP bar does not actually get any longer as we do this, like, as we pick up upgrades for it. Mm -hmm. It's just kind of like, you well, have more HP. Well, they don't want HP. it, like... <laughs> extending into the center of your screen. That would be a bit I don't much. know. I always kind of enjoy it in games like um, like uh, in Legend of Zelda where after a certain point... Uh, you just Link's, have so many hearts. You, yeah, Link is just like covered in hearts. 
Almost done. There we go. Hey, these guys themselves, not great EXP. They're like little dudes though. Pretty good. I think they also respawn, so like if I'm feeling terribly motivated, I can always come back and just run around this field shoot shooting things for a while. I just don't really see these as something that humans would build. No. What purpose would they serve? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know the point of them. It's why I'm starting to think that some of these critters developed themselves, or yeah, there was well, some I can other see, like, kind Victor of AI and force. stuff modifying things. Like I could, I guess I could kind of see the purpose of like a flying dr drone platform. Like, say you needed like a bunch of little hands to do little things for you. I could, I could see that being useful. Uh huh. Yeah, wow, there's so many there's so many places that we're not even going to be able to interact with yet. Okay. Yep, true Quactathon style. Right yeah. there. It's Ooh, a bit wow, that's a big sometimes. door too. Yeah, oh yeah. There's a ton of just like big things strewn all over the place. Is this a Hey, yeah, let's see. No, we oh, need it's yellow. yellow. Nope. I got it. Huh. There we go. Yeah. Never mind. Didn't record. Oh! Man. How how high level are these? Sevens? I don't know, but I got an instant extract. That one, Mac. Over there. What? Yep. Oh. Alright. I win. What? Yeah. What happened? That was, was, like, just the most, just, like... It was just defended. They just show up, and they're like, ooga booga, and then they all just die. And it's like, uh, uh, yes, sure. All right. What? All right, well, at least we get another core. At some point, I'll be able to fight that sort of thing off properly. But today, today is the day the cheese wins. Oh, there's green. Yep. That's a big gorilla. I also don't do damage to it. Ah, there we go. It has like hammer hands. Do it. Okay. Get him, Rats. Well, didn't get the <laughs> core, but that's okay. Yeah, so interesting, red doesn't hurt green. Now, I noticed that only the larger creatures seem to have the capability of changing their colors. Uh, it's yeah, it's kind of like champion enemies in like an MMO or something. You know, kind of the the extra special ultra. Oh hey, hard there's dudes. some mining over there. Yep, figured to grab that. Might as well grab as many resources. I think it all respawns, hmm. but I could be wrong. I think it all just just purely for that like core type. It's Is interesting nope. how they're using the rainbow. You know? Yeah. Uh, somebody actually compared this series to, um, or this gameplay to Jack and Daxter. Uh, to which I responded, I've never played Jack and Daxter, so I have no idea. And then I felt kind of guilty, because those, those, they always looked like such fun games. I just never got around to buying them, because... Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, I never had a PlayStation system, so there's that. I wonder if they did an HD collection like Ratchet and Clank. I believe they have, it. actually. Yeah, I'd have to look into it. It wasn't uh, Jack and Daxter Naughty Dog? Believe so. Okay. Ah, that sucks. Pretty much anything Naughty Dog does is, uh, or used to do back in the day has now been overshadowed by the fact that they make really good third-person shooter adventure games. Nope, that didn't work. Whoa. Backswiped you. It's okay. These guys are actually guys the are appropriate level. level. Oh, that didn't yeah. work. I give up. Okay, we're in trouble because reasons. I'm just going to hang out up here for a second. Okay, there we are. Yeah, why are these guys only level 3 and whatever? There we go. Mac does 4,000 damage. That's why Mac insta-gibbs things. <laughs> uh, 
you know those like stat points I've been throwing into yes, him? Yes, yes, you've been upgrading him Turns to out it's making him into something like ridiculous. I can't wait till we get the gorilla and it could just pummel everything for me and I don't even have to look. Okay. Nothing over there, though. It does look like there's some platforming stuff. We can't do that yet. Anyway. Um, we done? We oh, almost there's done. some more resources. Okay. Yeah. I do wish the uh, the collectible items would would magnetize into Jewel. Just like um, mm. just like the base resources. That's quite the chain. Also, well, this is a door here to a new area. By the looks of it, uh -huh. Core Foundry. Oh, yeah, yeah. But look up. Where does that dotted line go? Oh, the Core Foundry is up there. No, no, no. That door goes to somewhere else. This one. Where does the dotted line go? Uh, dotted line brings us all the way up here to the shifting sands. Interesting. Yeah. There's also Eden Tower. Which the core foundry, which is I believe up there, mm, we could actually do like that dungeon. It looks like you need the boots. Yeah, we need our we need our magnet boots first. Wow, we barely do damage to this guy. He is a massive one. Oh, interesting. Having having him stun it. Get him. Give him a shot. There we go. Wow. Yeah, I am useless in in comparison to. Uh, to your minions, that's probably why most much of the game relies on them. You feel like after a certain point, you should just be the Pokemon trainer or something, not even part of the battle, just kind of in the background, <laughs> being like. Hang on, it's another crawler. Ooh, nice. Okay, we finally might get some answers if I'd stop fighting things for a moment. <laughs> Oh no! Mac, wait. Oh, we get the spider drone next. I activated my beacon five days ago. Your canine unit took a long time to find me. Is he all right? Mac? He's fine. He hasn't been affected by whatever's making the other bots go crazy. This whole planet's gone crazy. <sighs> Kai Brent, core maintenance. Jewel Adams, atmospherics. I've been trying to scavenge parts to repair my leg, but we haven't been able to lure the big core bots close to our crawler. I can't move fast enough to hunt him down. And Seth? He's too scared to go out on his own. Well, if you want, Mac and I can find the things you need. Really? That'd be great. Here, take this. You'll need it more than me. <laughs> I've got a list of all the parts for my leg inside the crawler. I'll send it to you over the radio. Okay. Sure. And Jewel? I'm glad I'm not alone out here. Me too. <laughs> the, uh, the attachment isn't fully attached. Jewel, you read me? Yeah! Okay, so we have blue firing mode. I hear you, Kai. Go ahead. The parts I need should be in the nearby Corbot Hive. I'll mark it on the map for you. Okay, we're on our way. So, uh... They, but he didn't explain... Yeah, it. was that cutscene not, like, incredibly awkward to you? It was very awkward. It's <laughs> just like, oh, another human! Oh, my legs are screwed up! Oh! Okay, we'll go fix your legs for you, I guess. No, like... Like if he was like drastically injured and we to be temporary habitants. Once all the crews were awake, they were supposed to move into residential towers and other buildings closer to their work areas. But like if he if he needed like direct medical attention, all right, you know, it makes sense. Also, he didn't explain anything like how how long has he been awake versus how long she has. Yeah, I mean the implication and is because he's got messed up legs, it's been a while. Be the place. Hey, Kai, we're here. Great. The 
parts I need can only be found on hybrid spiders. Green ones. You got sounds easy enough? Well, the problem is these guys don't like sunlight. So you'll have to search for them under the sand and dig them up. <laughs> Mac we found a dig site. Right, Mac. Dig, dig, dig. You got the scent, Mac? No, he's so cute. Okay. Uh. Well, that's the spring piston. Yes? No. Give it a go. He needs to find a green uh, spider. That's what he's really digging for. I I guess. I'm just gonna. I kind of wish he'd just do this without me having to press X. Oh, there we that's... go. Uh, that's we want the green ones. too bad. But hey, it's level eight. Yeah. And it's also a color switcher. It's got orange. Maybe if you kill it on green, that will fulfill the mission. No, no, it's got to be, it's got to be green. She, remember she said it's not the right type? Right, right. It looks like it's only revolving between orange and yellow. Yeah. Which means it's got to just go with the regular. Is it just me or... Rush in. Oh. Yeah. I don't do any damage to it. I guess... I guess I'll have to do this manually. There we go. That makes sense. Why? Why uh, Mac can't uh, turf these things? He's he's red type or he's blue type. Mac, dig in. Okay. Well, that was cool. Keep doing that. <laughs> go, Mac. Go. Dig, dig, dig. Up. Oh. There and we go. There's there's blue or green. It'd be interesting if once I like we how these side dodge, how they twirl their legs around. Yeah. Oh okay. no, it's becoming blue. No, it's not a problem. So it just goes back yeah. to green. Yeah. It's just if you hit it with enough blue, it it turns blue or something like that. Like after a certain point it switches color. Wait, I what? wonder if that's going to have to be a boss mechanic later. Oh. If there's anything here. But that one, uh, it probably will eventually. Uh, just for extra damage. We didn't actually get the spring piston from it. We just got the, uh... We just got, just the, got core the core from him. Well, that's okay. Maybe you need to actually kill it, kill it. Not get its core. So that it actually drops its parts. No, no, I've definitely, I've definitely killed things by, like, extracting their core. And gotten free parts out of it. Let's see, did he drop anything? No? No, I, I swear, okay. you need to actually kill it. Okay, we'll give it a go. I'd be surprised if you don't get, like, a loot drop from it. It's because the core in and of itself is a loot drop. I guess? Well, let's see if we can get another one. I'll just kill it normally. I don't need green cores that bad. This is great experience, though. Mm -hmm. I'd like to point out. Considering we've been in mild, desperate need of them, of, uh, more EXP for a while, it's actually kind of helpful. Uh-oh. Yeah, so if you just shoot it with, uh, one color enough, it'll... It'll change colors. Interesting. Shielding itself. Okay, I gotta wait for my ammo to come back. There we go. Well, I mean, if you hit it with blue, I wonder if it would have gone back from yellow to green. Not sure. Because think color mixing. No, no, what are you doing? I thought we were going to actually kill it for once. Oh, yeah, good point. Yet, yeah, stop, please. It's a bad habit by this point. I know it is, but we wanted to see if it actually gave you the piston. Well, it did, so... See what I mean? Yeah. So it drops loot when you don't get okay. its core. <laughs> I really wish I could actually, like, get an upgrade at some point that I can just keep my dash going forever. <laughs> just, like, just moon boot your way across yeah. things? Yeah! Like, I, I really ho do hope this game has upgrades like that. Like, if, if you look hard enough, you can find 
like a, a straight up character upgrade that's I like the blue yellow and red cores personalities to suit a particular set of tasks the hybrid cores were by definition more flexible and i hoped better suited to unexpected changes in mission parameters hmm maybe those mixed cores led to independent thinking because of their adaptability no i still think it has to do with the black stuff probably the black stuff but it may probably made them more malleable oh yeah maybe Maybe that's the point. I don't know. So do we get to go inside his crawler next? Or does he just pop up for a cutscene? I don't know. We'll have to see. It is taking a while to load. Yeah. But then again, most of the... <laughs> most of the... Uh, yeah, this game has serious issues load. with loading. Which super sucks. Okay, so it looks like we are going inside Kai's crawler. Cool. Hopefully we get to teleport between them, though. I guess it doesn't really too matter too much, but still. I wouldn't mind going back to our crawler at some point and upgrade, uh... This Mac. This is perfect, Jewel. Thanks. Mac, be good. I'm sorry. It's alright. You never seen a human with legs like this, huh? I'm one of the lucky ones. They were able to amputate before the infection spread. <laughs> Dust devil. Class three outbreak. Hit Chicago first, <laughs> spread from there. We evacuated to one of the safe zones. Not fast enough. How about you? East or west coast? West, southern sector. Oh, I heard that got bad. You lose anyone close? My mom. Now I'm sorry. It's all right. My dad and I, we looked after each other. We were going to come to Far Eden together, but he had to leave Earth on a different ship. He must be up in orbit then, asleep with all the others, waiting for the terraforming to finish. Hey, Seth. Can you dial it up a little? Here. This might help. Where did you find that core? I've actually found more than one. But I don't know what they are. They're called prismatic cores. Top secret mandate tech. I've only ever heard rumors about them. They fix the pylon. And they work on other Far Eden systems too. If we find enough of them, maybe we can get the terraforming back on track. Or maybe do a whole lot more. I don't know for sure. But the core foundry might have the answers we need. I'll get my legs working and meet you there. In the meantime, Seth, you go with Jewel. Don't worry. You're safe with us. Right, Mac? <laughs> oh, they're so cute! 